Hi everybody and welcome to um, word problem 25. It's a read, draw, write. I've set it up ahead of time so and I will also post the problem in the um, along with the sheet so if you want to have it to look at you have it. It's kind of small so just a heads up. I also set up a timeline down at the bottom so I didn't have to do that while I was on camera with you guys. So remember that you can pause this at any time you need to when you are um, working if it makes it a little easier or if you feel like you can go on ahead and work without me feel free so it says michael spends 19 minutes on his math homework and 17 minutes on his science homework how many minutes does he spend doing his homework so this is a question so we're finding out how much time does he spend doing his homework. We want to know the total amount of how much time he's doing. So we have two time frames. We're gonna, we can either add those up, but it says it wants we um, it has a timeline. It actually says I didn't write this on here because I was running out of room. Model the problem on a number line and write the equation to solve it too. Um, so we want to know how much time Michael spends total doing his homework. So we're going to be doing some addition. So let's go back. Michael spends 19 minutes on his math homework and 17 minutes on his science homework. How many minutes does he spend doing his homework? So this is a great time for us to use the pebbles and the rocks, um, or the, peb the rocks and the hills method. So just a heads up on that. Um, that's what I'm gonna be doing. So I'm gonna jump right ahead to um, how many minutes does Michael spend on his homework? I'm gonna go right to 19 minutes. So if I know that this is 19, here's my 19 right here right before that. So I'm gonna do, that's 10, and then I'm gonna do a five, and then I'm gonna do a one, two, three, four. So there's four. So that's 10, five, and four. So we know that's 19 minutes. So now we have 17 minutes we need to figure out. So I'm gonna make it a little easier. I'm gonna do one, so it's plus one is 20. So then I'm gonna jump a 10 because that would give us 16 minutes to play with. So I'm gonna do five, 10. Oh, I'm gonna do a big hump here for 10. Should be a little bigger. So to cross that out and make that a six. So that's 20 plus 10. That would equal 30. We're at 30 minutes. Then I can jump. Can I jump another interval? I can, I can jump another five. So that'd be five. So if I cross that out, that leaves me, oops, with one, I crossed out five leave one minute left so then there's one minute right there so plus five Oop, I need to back it up a little bit so I'm gonna do that quite right equals 30 plus five equals 35 then I have one minute left equals 36 minutes so it did want us to show this on a number line um, it takes him 36 minutes. I'm gonna actually see if I can squeeze it in right here and do it tiny. So 19 and 17 equals seven, nine plus seven is six. Carry the one is 36. So I checked our math doing an equation too. It does want you to do the timeline and the equation on this problem too. Um, I guess my lesson for this is to write smaller so I have more room to work on this whiteboard. Um, so that is math prob or word problem 25.